Hey guys, Evan here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can transfer crypto from your crypto.com account to your MetaMask wallet. Before this video begins, I just want to disclose I'm not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice. It is at your own risk to make sure that you are doing everything correctly. But with that said, let's go ahead and get into the video. So first you wanna open up crypto.com and then you wanna click on the transfer button. Next, you want to select where it says withdraw. From here, you're gonna to want to select where it says external wallet. Then to add your MetaMask wallet, you need to go to the top right where you see the plus icon. Go ahead and click on that. Then you want to click on where it says wallet address. Next, click where it says Ethereum. Now for sending Ethereum to MetaMask, you want to use the ERC20 network. And the next step is we need to get our MetaMask wallet address. So let's open up our MetaMask app. Now here we want to click on where it says receive. And you want to click on where you see the copy button right here. Once you have done so, go ahead and paste your wallet address right here. And then you want to add a wallet name. So I'm going to type in MetaMask Wallet Ethereum. You can name this wallet whatever you want. Go ahead and click on continue. And now we have our MetaMask wallet right here. So what we want to do is click on withdraw ETH. And we need to enter in an amount of Ethereum that we want to send. So it would be a smart idea to probably send a test amount first before you send a large amount of Ethereum. Just in case you have entered in the wrong wallet address or you entered in the wrong network type, it's always a smart idea to send a test amount first. Yes, you will have to pay the gas fees, but it is better than losing a large amount of money by accidentally sending it to the wrong address. Once you have verified that everything is correct, go ahead and click on withdraw. It will probably ask you to verify your transaction and it could potentially ask you to wait 24 hours after adding your wallet address just for security purposes. But once you have done that, you should be able to send your Ethereum over to your MetaMask wallet. So I hope this video helped you guys out. If it did, please leave a like, but that's gonna do it for this video. Thanks so much for watching and I hope this helped you out.